Occlusion is the dental term for the way the upper and lower teeth come together. We sometimes call this your bite. When you bring your teeth together in a healthy and comfortable bite, your chewing muscles contract evenly, the jaw joints are seated into their proper positions at the base of your skull, and all of your teeth hit simultaneously and evenly. The upper teeth mesh neatly with the lower teeth, and the outsides of the upper teeth slightly overlap the outsides of the lower teeth. Another sign of a healthy occlusion can be seen when you shift your teeth to the side. Your canine or eye teeth should take up all of the forces. Notice how there is no contact on any of your back teeth. We also look at the distance between the upper and lower gum lines. The proper distance gives your face a pleasing proportion and allows your jaw joints and chewing muscles to work comfortably. Bite problems that aren't corrected can really affect a person's appearance and they can sometimes lead to problems with the jaw joints, grinding or clenching of teeth, headaches, increased risk of periodontal disease, teeth that are sensitive, fractured or loose, and the loss of tooth enamel at the gum line. It's important to deal with any potential problems early by having a complete bite evaluation. Adjusting, realigning or restoring teeth can prevent many future problems and ensure a comfortable and healthy bite. Crooked or misaligned teeth, also known as malocclusion, affects 74% of American adults. Left untreated, crooked teeth can lead to periodontal disease and create abnormal amounts of stress on teeth and jaws, which can lead to premature wear. The effects of crooked teeth can worsen over time and may adversely affect your overall health. Articulators are tools used to create simulations of jaw movements. There is a long history of attempts to simulate the complex movements of the jaw joints. But even today's machineries achieve only partial success. It is of the utmost importance that the articulator is correctly programmed. You can see the various settings on the hinges. To obtain individualized patient values, one would have to analyze the patient's masticator organs through axiography. Common 
common types of misalignment include crowding, spacing, deep bite, open bite, cross bite, edge to edge bite, and excessive overjet. Crooked teeth can affect your bite, creating unnatural stress and pressure, leading to premature wear. Teeth that are subject to excessive pressure can develop chipping and notches at the gum line. Over time, the excessive force may also cause flattened or worn down teeth, or chipping and fractures at the edges of teeth. Additionally, a bad bite may produce improper forces on the jaw joint that may lead to pain in the jaw, earache, and even headaches. Premature wear can lead to gum recession, poor bone support at the roots, loose teeth, and eventually tooth loss. Teeth that fit together correctly last longer and are likely to need less costly dentistry in the future. Crooked teeth can affect your periodontal health because it's difficult to remove plaque and bacteria from the crowded areas. Bacteria that is not properly removed will multiply and trigger periodontal disease, which begins as gum inflammation, redness, and bleeding while brushing and flossing. If left untreated, over time, gum inflammation will progress to chronic infection, soft tissue damage, receding gums, periodontal pockets, bone loss, and eventually tooth loss. These conditions can lead to painful repair and maintenance in the future, which could amount to thousands of dollars in expense and countless hours in the dentist's chair. Problems in the oral cavity are best treated in the early stages. The medical term for teeth grinding is bruxism. It refers to unconscious clenching or grinding of the teeth. Tooth grinding is based on repetitive unconscious movement of the masseter, temporalis, and other muscles of mastication, the primary chewing muscles. These are extremely strong muscles. People can commonly generate 150 pounds of pressure between their teeth. Many people grind their teeth at night. Over time, the pressure and grinding motion wear down the teeth and cause them to crack and break down. Tooth grinding also commonly causes headaches, jaw pain, and other problems. Many people are unaware that they grind their teeth, and the problem is identified only because of pain, dental problems, or when someone hears them grinding their teeth at night. The causes are not completely understood. Among the possible reasons are stress, and upper and lower teeth that are not properly aligned. Treatment is not always needed. Serious problems may be treated with medications, dental approaches such as mouth guards, and other techniques. This is Dr. Wright with Crawford Orthodontics. Malocclusion is when the teeth are crooked or crowded. Braces help get the teeth into a normal bite, where the molars line up properly, as do the canines. The front teeth also need the proper overbite and overjet. Many people have less than straight and perfectly aligned teeth. The problems that can arise from this include greater risk of tooth decay, uneven forces on teeth, excessive pressure on the temporomandibular joint, and embarrassment for cosmetic reasons. Orthodontic braces are one way to correct crooked teeth and malocclusions. Braces consist of brackets and molar bands that are cemented to the teeth. An arch wire is then threaded through the brackets and applies forces on the teeth pushing them in the desired direction. Treatment times can vary from six months to six years depending on the severity and complexity of the misalignment. Braces are usually made from stainless steel, but are also available in other materials. Gold-plated braces are used when a person is allergic to nickel, which is a component of stainless steel. 
Ceramic braces are the least visible braces because they are the closest to the color of the teeth. They are not as strong as steel, however, so treatment times may be longer. Lingual braces that are placed behind the teeth are another option, although they can hinder tongue movement. Hygiene is especially important when braces are worn. Regular brushing and flossing using a floss threader is a must. Cleaning around the brackets with a proxy brush is also recommended. After braces are taken off, it is typical to have to wear a retainer for some time so the teeth don't drift back toward their original locations. Essex retainers, which are clear and fit over the teeth, and Holly retainers that use a metal wire are the two most common types. Braces can help correct many of the problems caused by malocclusions and will also allow you to enjoy a beautiful smile.